So it is currently 3:40, and I was done with my studying quite a while back. And currently, I'm in my kurta. That's because I have my kathak classes for some time. So I thought before going for my class, I would like to clear out some stuff for you all. So many people have been asking me tips regarding whether they should take standard math or basic math. So ninth graders and the lower classes might be confused that whoa, we even have a choice in math. So see, this or uh, what happens that once you go to class tenth, there is an option that you need to choose. You should either choose. mathematics standard or mathematics basic so there is not a lot of difference no matter you take mathematics standard or maths basic your whole entire school year is going to be same the difference just occurs in your board exam and i'm going to tell all the information that my teacher has actually explained me so you guys can probably rely on this so yeah just my personal opinion so i have basically taken standard math because my aim is to pursue something in science and in 11th also i'll be taking the science stream which includes math so basic math generally it is an easier level of math which is asked in boards and in board this is applicable only to board exam not at all your internal exams internal exams are generally taken in the standard math format and in standard math format you can basically say the questions are a bit more 
more twisted and of a bit more higher level but in basic maths these are basic questions and the people who uh, from the beginning know that they are never going to take math in the future they generally go for basic math and the people who need to take anything that includes math in future they choose standard math so just in case like you choose basic math but now you want to take science stream in 11 like suddenly your mind switches up so you need to clear one more math exam and after that only you will be eligible to apply for a Stein stream. So that's why I generally prefer that I uh, suggest everybody to choose math standard because as far as I have seen there is not a lot of difference between basic math and standard math because the whole year anyways you're gonna learn standard math. So why not give the paper of that itself rather than giving that one level easier um, exam unless and until you are 110% sure that you're never in your life you're gonna choose math as a subject so yeah but math generally it's there in everything like nowadays you cannot do anything without math so that's why i prefer that i'll suggest everybody take math standard and not basic this might be applicable even for the nine graders who might be um coming to class 10 this year or who would come next year but this is quite helpful so I hope you guys understood the basic difference between basic math and standard math. So now what all I have done today, I just completed, not completed, I am done till the limitations of the Mendeleev's table part from chemistry. I made my notes, like these notes are a bit different. What I have done is I have taken one topic and written everything in detail about it and like they might be, I have basically written each and every topic as a 5 mark answer you can say. So yeah, that's quite a good practice for me. And now my further plans are like, I just studied for around two and a half hours. And now I have my Kathak class. My Kathak class has a lot of time till now. Like it's at 5.30 and I'm ready since 3.45 for some reason because I had a bath and who would change again and again, right? So I just wore my kurta. So now I'm planning to study for one more hour. And I guess I'll complete chemistry itself because I have left it halfway through. So I'll do that. And then I would go to my class and after coming back also I'll restart my studying. So yes, I'll quickly, you know, gather up all the supplies once again and then sit on to studying.